Welcome friends. Today's video gaming systems have some pretty incredible graphics, but I prefer the old school systems such as the Atari 2600 console. Now between 1977 and 1992, about 300 million units were sold at $189.95, which would be about $900 in 2023. Now this is really the first console with removable media. and performed a whopping 128 bit. Before we begin, I'd like you to guess which was the biggest selling Atari game in history, selling about 8 million units. I'll tell you at the end of the video. Long ago, we had to plug the Atari's RCA output to a 300 ohm switch adapter that screwed onto the VHF post on the back of the CRT TV. Today we're going to hook up the Atari 2600 to a HD TV. There were three different types of Atari 2600 systems. This was the original system, and this was the Darth Vader version. Probably because of the all black console. Coming out of the back of the Atari 2600 console is a very long RCA cable. One is for video and the other is for audio. And we need to hook it to back here. So I knew they actually had adapters at the local big box home improvement store. And this is an RCA to F insert or coaxial cable. And so with this adapter, we can hook the RCA end in here. So unfortunately, hooking the coaxial cable directly to the back of the TV did not work. So we're going to try another method that is also used. For our next method, we will be hooking up a VCR. We all have one of those laying around, don't we? We're going to use our RCA cable out of the console and hook it into the RCA to coaxial adapter. The coaxial cable runs into the back of the VCR. And we're going to use the video and audio cables out of the VCR. And plug into the appropriate inputs on the back of the TV. So let's turn the 2600 on. There is also a channel selector switch located here on the Darth Vader model and on the original model it's located on the bottom, channel 2 to 3. So if at first you don't see anything up on the TV screen, try switching the channel switch. I'm going to have to darken the room a little bit so we can see the TV better. <laughs> so I hope that helps you with your Atari 2600 hookup to a modern HD TV. And now I'll tell you which was the biggest selling Atari game. It was Pac-Man with about 8 million units sold. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. 
hit like and share. Thank you.